Hello everyone, Martin Hazy, Lord Mayor of Adelaide. Pleasure to be with you. This week's City of Adelaide Council meeting. The first item we discussed was the Stretch Reconciliation Action Plan 2018 to 2021, a plan which we periodically review every three years to make improvements. The exciting news is, as our efforts as we move closer towards reconciliation, is that we've now identified 50 achievable actions and outcomes which our team right across the organisation of the City of Adelaide will progressively implement over the next three years. The second item which the Council has decided upon was again smart parking. Now as you know from previous videos, Council has already agreed that on the 1st of July we'll be launching Park Adelaide. Now Park Adelaide is an app which you can download to locate and pay for on-street car parks in the City of Adelaide. In fact, 2,800 of them in the CBD. Now, you can still, of course, use the old system which you've been enjoying for many years. This is a option. This is giving you more choice. So you can use Park Adelaide to pay for your car park and what the councillors did this week is they agreed to be able to provide you with a 15-minute top-up. So if you're running late when you're coming back to your paid on-street car park in the CBD, you can top up for an extra 15 minutes at a cost of $5.50 to of course avoid an expiation, but more importantly, to enjoy your stay in the City of Adelaide. Earlier this year, I was very vocal on behalf of the community about the poor quality of the landscaping surrounding the mouth to the tunnel of the State Government Oban project just near East Terrace. Councillor Megan Hender recently moved a motion in the Council Chamber to call upon our administration to see what we could do about addressing this problem. Well, this week in the Council Chamber, the members unanimously decided that we will step in and we will make improvements, landscaping improvements, so that not only does the Oban perform well, it also complements our beautiful East Parklands. City Council is a member of a number of associations. Councillor Anne Moran moved a motion in this week's Council Chamber to instruct our administration to quantify the value of our membership of the Local Government Association of South Australia. That report will be coming back soon. Finally, this week is National Volunteers Week and City Council has some 270 volunteers who work right across our wonderful City of Adelaide and do an extraordinary job looking after the locals and the visitors to the City of Adelaide. I'd like to thank them. And this week I've been out and about talking with many of our volunteers saying thank you on behalf of Council, thank you on behalf of the community for the terrific work that you do. Thank you everybody, bye for now.